I'm Joe Johnson. As we launch into another edition of Beetle Brunch, a celebration of the greatest group in rock history, featuring the songs and stories of the Fab Four on stage, backstage, and in the studio. I'm Joe Johnson, and this is Beetle Brunch. Now we welcome Lennon artist and musician Tim Piper to take us through the short concert stage life of John in the 70s. Hey, Joe, great to be here again. Thanks for allowing me my Tim time to put my perspective on the Beatles' solo years, and I get to do John. Well, in 1969, folks, John Lennon and Yoko Ono put together the Plastic Ono Band, which consisted of Alan White from the group Yes, Klaus Vorman, John's old friend from Hamburg, who also did the artwork for the Revolver album, and the one and only Eric Clapton. Now, in Toronto, this was a rock and roll revival festival, so the likes of Bo Diddley and Jerry Lee Lewis, Little Richard, Fats Domino were all going to be there. So John was playing with his idols, and not knowing what to do, they just threw together a set in no time, and John opened with a, a Carl Perkins number that went a lot like this. Well, it's one for the money. Two for the show, three to get ready now, go get go, but don't you set my boots and shoes. Well, you can do anything, but they all for my boots and shoes. Now, the Plastic Ono Band had also just recently recorded and released a song that John had written about his heroin addiction and trying to kick the habit, and he smacked away at it with Yoko singing in the background. It's called Cold Turkey. Temperature's rising, fever is high, can't see no future, can't see no sky. Cold turkey has got me on the run. John and the band flew back to England. John mixed the album in a day, and it went to number 10, going gold. Live piece in Toronto. The times they are a changing. In 1971, John and Yoko attended this freedom rally for a man named John Sinclair, who basically got 10 years for the possession of two joints. And uh, the concert drew the likes of Phil Oaks and Commander Cody and the Lost Planet Airmen, Bob Seger, Stevie Wonder, amongst others. And John wrote this song particularly for John Sinclair, which helped free him. It ain't fair, John Sinclair, in the stir for breathing air. Won't you care for John Sinclair, in the stir for breathing air? Let him be, set him free, let him be like you and me. Got to, got to, got to, got to set him free. You know, the thing we loved about John is that he really walked the walk. In 1972, he saw a Geraldo Rivera report on the Willowbrook School in New York where mentally disabled children were being abused. And he and Yoko decided to throw a concert at Madison Square Garden in August of 1972. And they called it the one-to-one concert, and they raised more than one and a half million dollars for the Institute. He even played an old Beatles classic as part of the concert. You might remember this one. Hey, come on, fat top, be cool. Going up slowly, he got Choo, choo, I ball, he won. Holy roller, he got hair down to his knee. Got to be a joker, he just do what he please. Come together by now. Stop the war. Imagine there's no heaven. It's easy if you try. No help below us. Above us, only sky. Imagine 
Thank you. John Lennon live from the One to One concert, August 30th, 1972. As I pointed out a few weeks ago, that show is currently being remastered for Blu-ray. And thanks, Tim Piper, for taking us through the Lennon solo live years. Joe, I can't thank you enough. I always have a blast on your Beatle brunch. And for those of you who are in the Los Angeles area, this August, four weekends, Just Imagine at the West Valley Playhouse. Check us out at justimagintheshow.com. See you guys next time. Brought to you by the Beatle Brunch Club. It's the place where Beatle fans get together to listen to the show on demand with deluxe tracks not broadcast. Plus, go back in time and hear old brown shows, Beatle brunches from 20 years ago today and before. Join up for just pennies a day at brunchradio.com.